I'm Miller, this is Bowie, and on today's tutorial, we're covering tips and tricks on how much to feed your puppy. Knowing how much to feed your puppy isn't always easy, but if you follow our three simple steps, you'll keep them going strong for the long run, or walk. Ready to see how it's done? Glad to help. Step one, start with canned food. At six weeks, your puppy should be getting most of their nutrition from canned food without added water. Even though some little ones may need to nurse just a bit up to eight weeks. Once they reach that age, most puppies can start eating three meals a day, spaced roughly eight hours apart. They continue to grow and develop quickly at this point, so you're still in the sweet spot when it comes to giving them lots of quality calories. Quick note, if there's ever a need to bottle feed them, speak with a vet about choosing the right formula. Puppies younger than four months typically need anywhere from 125 to 2,000 calories per day, depending on their weight. For example, if they weigh 10 pounds, giving them right around 650 calories each day should do the trick. Not sure which canned food is best? Still unsure how much to feed them? A vet can help here too. Step two, watch those calories. It's time to start tapping the brakes when it comes to what goes in their bowls. The key here is to make sure they stay lean. It's especially important for larger breeds to help reduce the risk of developing orthopedic disorders like hip and elbow dysplasia. Toy breeds are an exception. They can develop dangerously low blood sugar levels when they aren't eating enough. For them, four meals every six hours is just about right. At this stage, make sure your pup's eating between 150 and up to 3,000 calories per day, depending on what the scale says. So let's just say they weigh 30 pounds. Go with 1,000 calories per day to get the job done. But don't let them get pudgy. That can lead to health issues later in life. In fact, the Association of Pet Obesity Prevention estimates that more than 55% of dogs are either overweight or obese. And the problem often starts in puppyhood. Step three, switch to adult dog food around 12 months. Now it's time to feed your pup the grown-up stuff while following the number of calories we went over in the previous step. It could be kibble, wet, dehydrated, or even fresh foods. The choice is totally up to you. A good rule to follow is to make the switch when they reach their expected adult height. For toy and small breeds, that's around eight to 12 months. Medium-sized breeds around 12 months. Large and giant breeds around 18 to 24 months. By feeding your pup the right foods in the right amounts from day one, you'll help keep them happy and healthy so they can be your bestie for years to come. I'm Miller and this is Bowie. As always, we want to hear from you. So like this video, drop a comment, and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching. Come on, let's go, Bowie.